Hi guys, before we get into this video, I just want to say a huge, huge, huge thank you to everyone who has commented, liked and shared my previous video. I was very nervous <laughs> before I posted it, even just filming it, I felt a bit weird doing it so i really do appreciate all of the love that you guys have shown thank you also so much for all of your encouragement and support it means so much to me knowing that i just have so many people around me who are encouraging me on this journey but yeah, i just wanted to say a quick thank you before we got into today's video hi guys hi guys welcome back to my channel in today's video we are trying out new skincare finally well i say new skincare but this is old skincare because i bought this like last november in today's video we are using the rodeal b venom super serum mini <laughs> for the very first time like i just said i bought this serum in november i bought this black friday so like november december last year it is september the 18th so it's literally the end of september it's almost been a year since i bought this this is a first impressions video but if you stay tuned to my channel i will be updating you guys on this serum anyway guys i've been talking for uh, like 28 minutes and 15 seconds. So let's just jump straight into the video. Howdy gang. Okay, so let's just jump straight into it. Like I said in my introduction today, we are using the Rodeal B Venom Super Serum. This comes in two sizes. What I have here is the mini. This mini is 10 mil and it is 60 pounds on the website. This also does come in a bigger size, which is 30 mil and it is 160 pounds on the website. So very pricey, <laughs> quite a pricey thing although i'm pretty sure when i got this because it was over black friday they had an offer on so i didn't actually pay 60 pounds for this i think i paid no to be honest i don't know if i can find my receipt then i will put the price on screen so i'm on the rojo website right now and rojo says experience an elevation in skincare with the rojo b venom super serum featuring innovative b venom technology to help achieve a revitalized and healthy looking complexion we love that containing melatonin peptides ethically derived from b venom that work to smooth and firm the skin for a plumper fill appearance this lightweight serum also delivers a complex of high performance plant stem cells extracted from red chili peppers known to improve elasticity if there's one thing that you should know about rojo is they are very um they're very experimental they're very innovative with a lot of the ingredients that they put into their products so if you are ever using a rojo or skincare product just know that there is going to be some kind of crazy ingredient in there that you're like how the hell did you find that and put that into a skincare product that is one thing that i have to rate rojo for and it's one of the things that i do love about the brand is that they're very innovative in their products in terms of the key benefits this has b venom melatonin peptide which helps to smooth and firm p cell helps to improve the skin's elasticity for a lifting effect marine collagen helps to plump the skin through elasticity red seaweed extract is known to have skin smoothing and moisturizing properties and gluconolactane pha helps to gently exfoliate the skin for a smooth complexion and then lastly they say that this is an ultra lightweight silky serum so basically that is the serum in a nutshell they also say on the website that this mini one doesn't come in a box when i received it i just received it just like this in its like container thing and then a bit about the actual b venom line i would describe this as their most hard-hitting anti-aging skincare technology line so if you are looking to maybe prevent the signs of aging help with your signs of aging just do a lot more for your skin in terms of improving elasticity getting your skin to feel and look smooth getting your skin like plump reducing fine lines then the b venom line they're saying could actually be very well suited for your skin i talk about this all the time but i'm turning 30 next year and i don't know i feel like 30 is almost like that arbitrary age where suddenly your life just changes like that so for me i want to start gearing up and really start focusing on the anti-skincare side of my skincare routine for the last couple of months years even i've always been about hydration dark spots high pigmentation discoloration and those kinds of things but now that i'm nearing my big 3-0 i do want to start looking a lot more closely at anti-aging products and using products that will just help to keep me looking youthful for longer it's funny because i always laugh that i get id'd everywhere i go but suddenly i'm like i still want to be getting id'd even when i'm like 40 years old and the way that we're gonna keep on with that is to just really get onto the anti-aging skincare routine so i think with all of that out of the way let's jump into using this serum before we get into using the serum I'm just going to do my base skincare which is toner and essence i'm really sad that these two look like they could be finishing in the next couple of weeks because like I've said in my previous video, I'm not going to be rebuying them, so that kind of hurts me quite a bit. <laughs> okay, 
okie dokie guys so now that my skin has been prepped it's hydrated we've got the toner on we've got the essence on these two products also help for your skincare to just naturally sink in a lot deeper into the skin as well so now that we're ready with all of that i'm going to bring you guys in closer so we can look at this bee venom and i can give you my first impressions on it so here i have the bee venom really excited to give it a try so let's get into opening Oh wow, that dries down really fast. Okay guys, so while we're in this close, just wanna give you a couple of my first things that I've noticed, first impressions. First of all, this dries down incredibly quickly, so you need to move fast with it. There are a lot of serums that I've tried in the past that they kind of take their time to dry down and all the rest of it, and you're kind of walking around with a bit of a wet face before you put on your moisturizer. This serum dries down super fast, so you really need to make sure that you spread it out fast, because otherwise it will just dry down literally in like two seconds. Like I've just put it down and my forehead is already dry, and I put on quite a bit on my forehead. Um, in terms of the smell, this kind of has the typical rodeal smell, which is like cheap kind of perfumey smell. I never know how to describe it, but it doesn't, I personally really like the smell of a lot of the rodeal skincare products. And this definitely has that kind of trademark rodeal scent. So just be mindful of that. If you have tried other rodeal products, then it kind of has a similar smell. My face feels incredibly smooth, incredibly soft, like literally, right off the bat. I did want to focus this mostly on my forehead because my forehead is like my problem area. As you can see actually, I have like all of these like spots, like my two horns coming up. My forehead is literally my problem area for breakouts, lines. I've noticed like lots of lines on my forehead, especially when I'm wearing makeup. So I did try to focus this more on my forehead area, which needs all of the lines smoothing out as possible but in terms of the rest of my face i think it is okay i can't say so much for hydration because i've just put it on but if you see my face is looking a bit gray before i put this on my face was looking really brown and like glowy and dewy so i think this is i don't know like i feel like this kind of has like a mattifying thing to it and it could dull out your skin like if you just see kind of like around the outside my face is not as like peppy as it was before i put it on but hopefully that doesn't make my skin super dry i'm going to be using this over the next couple of days i guess for as long as this takes to finish so i will keep you guys updated on this serum and how it goes be nice first impressions goes it was fine i don't feel anything like untoward or anything like that i think rodeal skincare products the first time i use them they are usually very good like the first time it's only after a couple of days weeks that i start to notice things about my skin so i will for sure keep you guys informed on this um so yeah guys let's get on with the rest of the morning skincare routine Now that I'm dressed, I've let my face cream settle in. We're going on to moisturizer. Right now, I'm using the B Skincare Solar Defense Sunscreen SPF 50. This is the mineral sunscreen. This is the first mineral sunscreen that I've tried in a very long time. And I really like it and I really do recommend it. And I think this is something that I can see myself repurchasing. Et voila! We are done. Skincare is done. Just gonna pop on some lip balm. So, lip balm is on, finally. Okay, guys, so that is me done with today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. It's been a long time since I've used Rodial skincare products and it's been nice to use it again. So far, so good on this. Like I said, this is just a first impressions video. This is the first time that I'm using it, so I don't really have a lot to say about the serum, but stay tuned to this channel for updates on this. The main thing for me is that this does dry down really fast, so if you're using this, you need to move quickly. And it does have like a perfumey kind of smell to it that I'm not a huge fan of, but for me, all of the Rodial skincare products that I've tried have smelled like this so it's nothing that i'm shocked or surprised by maybe i thought it would smell a bit sweet and almost like honey because you know bees but you know what i'm not that fussed about it i'm intrigued to see how this works i'll let you guys know how this goes in the meantime if you guys have any questions on the serum any questions 
really at all about any of the skincare products that I've used in today's video, let me know. I would have been using this serum for a little while by the time this video goes live, so I'll have more information on this serum. I will also have both the full size version and the mini version linked down below in the description box, so make sure you check out the Roja website as well for more information on the B Venom line and on this particular super serum as well. Okay. That is all done. So yes guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video again. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. And in the meantime, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.